Hi, welcome to Be Joan Style. Today I'm really excited because I'm going to be sharing with you guys just different ways that I'm styling up accessories right now. I usually kind of go in this rotation of accessorizing. I get really into something and then it's just over and over and over I wear them all the time. And for me, that's actually all about the neck right now. So in the past, it's been about just the statement necklace. It's been about the statement earring. Last year, I feel like rings were huge. And then of course, we all did the arm party. Um, but right now, it's all about the neck. It's about wearing scarves. It's about wearing chokers. It's about wearing uh, really cool necklaces really close to your neck. So I'm gonna show you how I've been accessorizing my neck. So the first accessory that I'm using a lot is this traditional bandana handkerchief. I'm sure you guys have seen this a lot. It's all over the Pinterest boards right now. Everybody's kind of pulling out their bandanas and using that a lot. So the way that I've been wearing it is basically just kind of taking the bandana and bunching it up and putting that around my neck and just tying it really simply in the front with one and then two knots. Mm -hmm. So the key to wearing this trend is actually really not wearing it so much with a traditional Western look. It's throwing it in where you least expect it, even kind of how I'm wearing it today with just like a simple white shirt and some high-waisted trousers. You really could wear like a sweatshirt and throw this on with it, a t-shirt, a great blazer, just mix it into the looks that you wouldn't expect to see a handkerchief bandana. So that's uh, just one of the things I'm wearing. So the other one that I'm wearing is similar to the handkerchief. It's just that classic square silk scarf that your grandma maybe had or your mom, or you can find it in a vintage shop or a thrift store, or of course, any store probably in the mall. But this one is my current favorite. I love it because it's brown and black and I love that color combo. I love mixing it in because it, to me, it's almost like a neutral that you can wear with anything. So the way that I'm wearing this is I'm folding it just down into a kind of triangle shape. And then I'm gonna put it on my neck and kind of bunch up the ends a little bit and then wrap it around and then tie it here in the front and do it in two different knots. And then I might just take this piece and kind of tuck it under and let the little ends hang out with that. This is really similar to the handkerchief that you can kind of throw it on with anything. I like the idea of even wearing like a slip dress and this and a great cardigan. Wear it with like a button up and a blazer and this and a great fedora. So really, again, this can kind of be mixed into a lot of your looks. So this one is a little bit different. You may have noticed a throwback has been happening to the 90s with chokers. And I'm all about going to a thrift store and finding those old chokers that I used to wear for me in middle school. But I've also just kind of seen like a black ribbon choker that I love. And I was recently kind of wanting to wear that look. And so I pulled out some opaque black tights and I just cut them. So first I cut a really thick piece. And the way that you wear this is you just put it around your neck and then you can kind of make it any width that you want. For me, this look is a little bit more about having that thick band around your neck. And nobody will know, but you're wearing a pair of tights around your neck. And I love the idea of wearing this with kind of like a cool floral grunge dress, this, even my hair slicked black like I'm wearing it right now, and maybe throwing a great sweater over it and some boots. So that's kind of the traditional 90s look. Another way to wear it would be maybe throw in like a great midi length pencil skirt, a simple white tee or a simple colored tee, and then just wear this and kind of go for that really cool minimal look. Okay, and then I actually took the same pair of tights and I cut a smaller choker piece. So I, what I do with this one is you could just wear it simple like this and just have a thin one. What I've been doing inspired by the Gucci runway is I've been taking a floral pin. This is from Bando. It's actually either a brooch or a hair clip. And what I do with it is I actually just clip it to the choker. So I'll just take the hair clip part and I'll put it on the choker and kind of put it off to the side like that. So it's kind of got this really cool funky little vibe going on. Recently I wore it very Gucci and I did the whole beret look and this and a dress and I think I did a leather jacket. Um, another look I've done it with is kind of like a bohemian kind of more flowy dress and then threw this on and then I wore like a black wide brim hat. 
And so it just gives something unexpected to the look and I'm loving it. Basically, it all comes down to just playing dress up and working with what you have in your house. And I live by that play dress up motto all the time. Half the time, I'm not going anywhere exciting, but I just like having fun and I feel like I have a much better day if I'm in something really fun and I'm expressing myself in a really creative and different way. So do that for yourself. Anyways, I hope you liked getting to see the ways that I'm styling up accessories right now, what's on rotation for me all the time, every morning when I'm getting dressed. Um, I'd love to hear your comments or if you guys have any thoughts, leave comments below. And of course, please subscribe to the Be Jones Style channel. I will be having new content come out every Thursday. And so I'll see you guys next week.